I like music, so it's time that we make some music. There is a tab here in the blocks for music. You can play tones, you can play ringtones. There's a slight difference between them. I like to play tone before I play a ringtone. Um, how long to rest. It's got some built-in melodies. Uh, some things to change, change tempo, set tempo. So again, some various things there, change the beat. So let us play some music again uh, on startup. Let's make sure that the, the program's working. But then let's use uh, some buttons. And right now we're still using the A and the B button. So when we press button A, let's play some music. Let's play a tone. Now if you click on the tone, you notice piano shows up. Uh, also, this number shows up. That is the hertz for the key that that's at. And it gives you a little test for it. Uh, you can type in any hertz you want. Uh, not every hertz is a key on a piano. So you have to be careful about that. Um, our hearing ranges from 20 hertz to 20,000 hertz. Roughly, um, there's a question about whether the micro bit can produce that, all the, the ranges, and whether the speaker can actually produce it also. So if you go to the extreme end, you might have some trouble with the sounds. Um, so let's just pick uh, middle C, and we'll play that for beat again. You can change this, half beat, quarter beat, eight beat. You start stacking in um, tones here. Um, Let's go with, uh, see what happens again. The emulator lets you show some things. So play them one after the other, because we said to play it for a beat. Now how you play multiple tones at once, I don't, I haven't played enough with it yet to figure that out. There's, I don't think there's a way. You know, play like a chord. I don't think there was a way, but we did something to research. So we're going to play for B, and let's see what we're going to Let's uh, use button B. Oh, heck, we can just copy this. Oh, look, I copied the whole thing and changed that to button B. And I want to play their melody that they've got. Some built-in stuff. Let's go Ode to Joy. Um, so you notice over here it's showing um, a plug, like an MP3 kind of player kind of thing, like a headphone, and it shows it going to zero and ground. The micro bit defaults to zero being where a sound type signal, it doesn't actually send sound, it sends an electrical signal, um, where the sound signal is going out defaults on zero and hooks up. To, now, if you have headphones and not a speaker, you can hook your headphones up this way. Um, one of the alligator clips goes to this end of the plug and the ground goes to the other end of the plug. If you've got a speaker, a speaker's got two places to plug, a positive and a minus is usually what they're called. It doesn't really matter which way you plug them in. The only thing you'd have to pay attention to is if you have multiple speakers plugged in that you want um, ground always plugged into the, the same one. So if you got ground plugged into the positive on one speaker, you want ground plugged into the positive on the other speaker. That's the only thing. And then I've got you know ground and zero plugged in on my micro bit. Um, again, download the file. No. And yeah, yeah, you tell me all that stuff. Let's go there. My micro, it's there. It's downloading here. It is there. Let's drop it on. And then I will play it for you. It's not really loud, but it's good for local. If you need it to get louder, you're going to have to send the signal to an amplifier of some kind. It would be a mini amplifier or a big amplifier, it doesn't matter. Um, so here's the sound. And here is the ode sound. Hi. 
I found that speaker at Parts Express online for like a dollar. Here is a little piezo. Here's a little buzzer. How it sounds on this little buzzer. The buzzer is also like a dollar. I'd buy the speaker before I'd buy the buzzer. So here's the first. I'm having it at the same location. And you can barely hear it. So, again, speaker, much better. So, that's that speaker, SPK 1495AR. Um, Parts Express had them on discontinued uh, uh, for sale kind of thing. I, I imagine it's pulled out of some component. I couldn't find them on Amazon. Um, if you can't find this one, you're going to have to try some little dollar speakers that you can find somewhere. Um, again, you can use a headphone if you want. Um, just try any speaker if you want to. It's just need it. It's got to have two places to connect.